Good afternoon everyone, this is Eric, Northwest Bus Sales. Appreciate your time checking us out. Get a load of this 2015 Ford E450 Eldorado Aerotech. This is a dandy, I really think you're gonna like it. So let's check her out. You got the V10, 6.8 liter V10 underneath the hood on this baby. This thing is in primo shape. Step treads, in great shape, not showing a whole lot of wear. A couple of grab bars coming in. You got a first aid kit here, fire extinguisher right there. Road hazard triangles behind the driver's seat. I'm gonna zoom in on that, look at that. Power driver's seat. Mm. All the upholstery in this bus is in fantastic condition. I think oh, you're you're not going to be disappointed. Armrest, no less. I can't stand the bus when it doesn't come with an armrest. Tell you what. All right, look here. Let's get down to it. Look at the miles on this baby. Thirty-four thousand six hundred thirty-four miles on the six-eight V10 gas engine. That is child's play for that engine. Power and heated mirrors right over here. Look at this. Power windows and locks. I should say window and lock because it is not a dual door chassis, which that may, this is very unusual for a single door to have power window and lock switch. Usually it's the dual doors that have that. So switch panel right here for your electric entry door, dome lights, and then the wheelchair lift switch right there. Passenger heat switch, your standard E-Series van. You know, heat and AC switches there for the driver, AM, FM, CD player, and then there you go. That's for the passenger AC. All right, all right, let's keep moving. Oh, Roscoe, backup camera integrated into that rear view mirror. Right up here, we got the J-Box. Look at all that. LED diagnostic, fuses, relays, what have you. The passenger area is in tip-top shape. Look at the padded gray kind of carpet up top there. That adds an, an extra measure of sound suppression. So the blue interior on the uh, blue vinyl on the Friedman mid-high backs with seat belts, aisle side armrest, and anti-vandal grab handles. That makes those seat backs last a lot longer so people are more inclined to grab those handles than they are the seat back when they go to stand up rather than breaking down the vinyl and the foam there. Cool feature. 2015, this thing's in great shape. I got the rear AC blowing cold right now. Look at that. So this is a 14 passenger. Look at these two solo saddles right here in the back. So you've got, you can do a couple of different configurations on this. You've got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, and then the two solos in the back make it 14. Or you can flip these babies up, check it out. Flip those up, and then you got room for two wheelchairs. So it could be a 12 and two, or total of 14. There's your wheelchair securement straps right there the tracking going through the floor right there so you can securely mount the wheelchairs how about it retractable seat belts believe it or not they all don't come with retractable seat belts big tour style windows that are tinted with some sliders up top there courtesy lighting going down both sides there in the transition panel what the oh we got a we got a daggum light that ain't working here don't worry, we'll get that taken care of. Passenger heater underneath these seats right here. Man, the upholstery's in great shape. All right, I think that'll do it on the inside. Let's cruise around outside right quick. I could pop the hood on this thing for you if you like, but you can't see a daggum thing anyways underneath there. So check out the tire tread, this thing's got Michelin's on it, really good shape, ton of life left on them. See that? AC's blowing cold, that's what you got dripping there. Condensation from the AC lines. Mmm, this thing's clean. 
Let's walk around outside a little bit, check her out. Good tire tread all the way around. Look at that. Oh, that looks like a new cat underneath there. I reckon that was probably cut out of there at some point. This bus came from the Portland, Oregon area. Me and a couple other guys brought some back and they performed wonderfully. So I actually got another one I hope to do a video on today for you guys. It's a 2018 Eldorado Aerotech and if I remember right, that thing's only got like 10,000 on it. So, and they're matching units. It's a 2018 with only 10. So anyhow, let's give this wheelchair lift a a go hit the power switch down there and hit unfold brawn wheelchair lift 800 pound capacity look at that and then you hit down smooth operator i like these brawn wheelchair lifts they're kind of the industry leader if you will you see a lot more of these than the than the Rikons or the Maxons. To be honest, I don't even think Maxons making wheelchair lifts anymore. You typically see those, those lift gates and stuff on those medium duty trucks, stuff like that. So pretty much it's either gonna be a Braun or a Rikon these days, but it seems like it's more Braun than anything. And then you hit fold, look at that. 800 pound capacity. That's kind of the standard for these babies. Just like that. All right, let's keep moving here. Eldorado Aerotech. There's my nephew, Bo, over there on the blower. There he goes. I'll tell you what, that boy ain't right. Okay, that's my, my, my other nephew. That'd be Jack's cousin. So let's keep moving here. Exterior, man, it's in good shape. I am gonna zoom in here on the back. I did see some infirmities. I don't know if you can see it right there, but somebody got a little overzealous with a razor blade whenever they decided to remove the previous lettering on here. Look at it. And there's a number of spots. Can you see that? I hope the camera's picking it up. That is a daggum shame. Backup sensors there on that, on that rear bumper. rear that rubber bumper i think they call that like a i can't remember what they call it is it the romeo bumper or something like that rear impact absorbing bumper something like that led lights all the way around front and rear on the sides there's your fuel fill right there oh i want to show you this under here check this out nice suspension upgrade right there more ride suspension proves the ride quality a bit pretty cool you get a look at the undercarriage there like i said this bus came from the portland oregon area i think it was from a transit authority as well good tire tread good enough to have rocks stuck in it right here there's your ac condenser and fans you can hear those babies going diamond plate running board Yard. When the sun hits this right, hits those billboards right, you can kind of see, I think it says Parks and Rec on it. So yeah, came from probably Portland Parks and Rec, if I had to guess. I don't know if it's Portland proper or not, but looking good. 34,000 on this. Oh, I do see a bump, a dent in the front bumper. Can you see that? Don't think you can see it on the camera, but it's there, not bad. Got bumped into something there. All right, LED clearance lights up top there. I think that'll do it. I'm going to sum it up right here. 2015 Ford Eldorado, 14 passenger or 12 with two wheelchair capacity, 34,000 miles on the V10. Appreciate your time checking us out. Give us a look online with any questions, or pardon me, give us a look online and give us a call with any questions. 800-231-7099.